Welcome to downtown Tempe where the Arizona State basketball program put on Moonlit Madness on October 29th. My fellow men's basketball reporter Sam Stern and I had the chance to catch up with some of the players after the event. So let's cut back to the action and hear what they had to say. You were kind of doing all kinds of stuff today and putting on a show. Talk to me about it. Little something, something, man. I tried to tell Coach Harley before practice today, go light so I could save my legs for the, uh, for the dunk contest today. But, man, we, we close to the season. He said we can't do it. So, I mean, I had to go out there and do the best I could. D DJ, what's the excitement like going into the season? Obviously, kind of a new team, a lot of players coming in. But what's the expectations early on? Uh, brand new team. Uh, I think the chemistry and everything has been going great so far for it to be a new team. Uh, but, you know, Coach Harley has been telling us about last year how we can't be like that at all this year. So I think that's just our main focus is trying to bounce back from last year and get back in the win column. DJ, I appreciate it. Yeah, appreciate Thank you. So Marion Jackson, just wanted to ask you, what an electric night in Tempe tonight. What was the highlight of your night? Uh, just, you know, having fans out here, you know, me experiencing this for the first time, it's a blessing. You know, I can't wait to fill up DFA and, you know, get the crowd rocking. We get to see some of those dunks in game this season? Or what, course, what are we thinking? Of course. Y'all going to see a lot of dunks on this team. We only had three in the dunk contest, but we got a lot of guys that could jump out the gym. So. Yeah. Talk, talk to me about how excited you are for the season to start. Obviously, a lot to be excited for, kind of a new team. What are your expectations? Uh, we got very high expectations for ourselves. We, we plan on coming out every game, playing hard, and winning as many games as possible. Thank you so much. Okay, give me your thoughts on tonight. How exciting was it to just get out here with all the fans and get the season going? Uh, no, it was really exciting, you know. With COVID last year, we didn't really get to interact with fans. It was nice seeing some of the new guys uh, get to uh, showcase what they can do, get to introduce themselves to the yeah. fans. Uh, I think it was fun. The Sun Devils will kick off non-conference play with a home game on Tuesday against Portland. For Sam Stern and the rest of the WCSN crew, I'm Nick Borgia signing off.